Hey everyone, welcome back to Malik's Place. As you notice, we have a body of Lydia here, uh, which is not the correct Lydia. This is actually... <laughs> I attempted to um, type in the command consoles, uh, but this is not what I was looking for. Uh, it basically made a clone of her. So we're attempting... Hey! There she is. She's still alive, too. Wow. What the hell have you been? Okay, well, uh, uh, pay no attention to this. You don't, you don't want to know what happened. Okay, well, it's good to know that she's, one, still alive. Uh, I had been concerned that she was dead, and that I was basically going to be summoning a corpse and have to debate whether or not, uh, to, uh, resurrect her or not. But thankfully, I just, I think she, maybe she just got stuck somewhere. I don't know. It, it tends to happen sometimes. Uh, it's the one thing, I don't like using command, uh, console commands, but um, in this case it was kind of a necessary evil because I've, I've had this happen before with Black, um, Black Fathom Depths. I had gotten, I'd lost Ayla somehow, and I had no idea where it was, and it was vanilla Skyrim, uh, no add-ons when I had done it, and what ended up happening is I couldn't, at the time I couldn't get another companion because she was missing, and I couldn't find her. So I made the assumption that something had killed her, or something had, she was stuck on something, I couldn't, I never found her, I couldn't find anywhere where she ended up being, so, um, that game kind of is lost to the wind. Um, now I have, nowadays I have follower, um, find follower and stuff, so it would make it easier to find them this time around. I don't have that one added now, uh, although I am probably going to add that map marker thing in the future so I can avoid problems like this in the past. Okay, well as you can see, I'm horribly lost in here, trying to find my way up to the next section. Just got to be this way. But yeah, there's uh, lots of little fun things. In fact, I just... Oh, I emptied this chest. Okay. Now, I just have a feeling that I think I went too far down. Let's see. Around this corner. Nothing, so let's try climbing back up. But yeah, um... I guess I've technically used uh, Resurrection before, but I feel like it should be something that's in the game, too, because you spend constant amount of time just, like, like, I've had, there's been games where I've played, when I play through, and then halfway through, I'm not even, I haven't been to the town in forever, I'll get a note saying someone was killed um, in an attack, and I know that happens, but it's just frustrating. It should be, like, you should be able to go resurrect people if you have, like, mastery and restoration or something. And I am horribly lost. Oh, here we go. Duh. I always seem to miss this part. Cross the bridge. Oh. I remember. <laughs> what the? Okay, I guess I'm supposed to run through right when I pass or something? What are you doing? Sorry! You did just walk into my way. feeling about everything. Whoa. I'm trying to 
trying to remember. Oh! Excellent. Actually, I can see it now. Ah! Ow! Lydia! That, damn it! Oh, okay, I see now. She's not dead. Get off me, Lydia. Ah! Okay. Well, no horn. Somebody stole the horn and killed only a couple Draugr and left the rest for me. They are a dick. No, did they leave me anything else here? No, they left me nothing else. Nothing. They stole it And they're telling me to meet them in this one place. They are... Oh, okay, maybe they... Maybe they did leave me something. I don't know. Glass sword. War axe. Glass sword I can sell. For some money. came in backwards, I guess. I don't know. Never been made quite clear to me how they got through these tunnels. Okay. Well. I guess it's just up to me to uh, figure out where to go next. in here. A couple of potions. Looks like the exit's this way. God damn. Well, that's infuriating. I don't think you should make a quest where it's automatic fail and then say, you failed. Although I do tend to do that with Mass Effect 2. Uh, I've let my nieces play it, and the first time they did, when the, there's a scene where basically at the very beginning of the game, Shepard dies. I'm like, oh, you lost. It's my turn to play. No, I want another chance. I had them going back and playing it over and over again. It was quite mean-spirited a little bit, but it was still funny. 
All right. So it looks like the closest town is Solitude. Grr. Um, looks like maybe we'll hit up Dim Hollow and then make our way to Dawnstar. And from there we can make a decision on where to go next. Friends, it's not stealing if you're friends. Oh, hey, another mine though. Perfect. Detour. Super speed. Stones Hill. Iron. Well, it's iron. We've got lots of iron. Check my Mac again, and we're going north and east. More east and north, which means this is probably it over here. south now. Whoa. Well, okay, I'm goofing up big time. Cave's over there. No wonder I wasn't able to run. Rock wallow. Yes, I'm being this stubborn about it. 
See, and actually I can see right up there. I think I can see the cave. Aha! See? In the hollow crypt. Alright, well, we've made it into the dim hollows. If I remember correctly, this puzzle is a pain in the butt. So I think we're going to call it here, and we'll pick it up as the next part of Malik's plays. Um, maybe a little more extended so we can get through the entire cave. In the meantime, I'll see you all in the gaming universe. I'll see you next time.